Well, Brandon, we've just spoken to Carlos and he says that you guys feel like that's two points lost. Is that something that the players echo? Yeah, I do think it's a, a bit of a sombre dressing room today, to be fair. Um, obviously, we always set ourselves high expectations and today, uh, with the the way we felt that we dominated the game, we definitely um, knew that we could have got a few more points today um, and that would have left us in good stead for the international break and to really climb the table. But still positive at the same time and we know we've got a job to do when we get back. On a personal level, how good did it feel to be back out there? I know you've hated not being involved the last few weeks. Yeah, I mean, it's felt awful. You see me looking down, walking past the office and that. But um, no, I'm super happy to be back on, on that note. So, um, yeah, as you know, we're, we're a tight-knit group. So even though I was away sort of thing, it was good to still be in and around the boys, see the good performances. Um, and I'm just happy that I can come and contribute something now. So, um, yeah, I'll take this in my stride in the, the couple of weeks break and then we'll go again. Yeah. Did the hammy feel okay tonight? Yeah, yeah, I felt really good to be fair. Um, I think now that I'm back on the pitch, it's just about getting back in the swing. Um, and I, I mean, this this break, I probably wish that there was a game in a few days, but um, I'll just use it to, you know, get a bit more strength, a bit more speed and, and sharpness under under me and use it as an opportunity to not only get to the level I was at, but to, you know, uh, get past that and keep, keep pushing. So, yeah. And just back to the game, Brandon, in terms of creating chances, there wasn't too many that we were able to to carve out tonight. Are the lads disappointed that they weren't able to pepper Cardiff's goal a bit more? Yeah, I think it's always hard because you have teams uh, do respect us a lot as a group and obviously the manager's um, tactical now. So they often set up quite defensively um, and it makes makes it hard to sort of break teams down at times. Um, and that does call on us attackers to sort of think of things and um, to be creative. And obviously we have the players and the means to do that. Um, I think, yeah, obviously we know that we have higher expectations uh, of ourselves than what we showed, but we're, yeah, we're, we're working on it and we're, we're going to look to uh, build on that next game. And just looking ahead to the weekend, obviously we haven't got a game. Our playoff rivals will have an opportunity to increase their lead over us. Will you lads be watching that? Is it something to be be aware of or is it focused fully on ourselves when we come back from the international break? Yeah, no, we just focus on ourselves. I mean, we know we're all going to end up on 46 games by the end of it. So uh, teams are going to play around us. We'll have days where we're playing there not and vice versa until the end of the season. But what we know is when we're on the pitch, like today, we want to take um, we want to take as much as we can from every game, which is why we're so frustrated. But with that mentality, I think it will get us where we need to be, just being focused on ourselves. Because you see, if, you can, if you're can, if you focused on the rest of the table, it can sort of distract from what you're doing and... We, we know we, where we want to be and we're going to do what we can to get there.